हाय आई एम पुष्कर पटवर्धन डी एस पी सॉफ्टवेयर आर्किटेक्ट एट केडन स्टेंसिलिका एंड टुडे आई एम गोइंग टू टॉक अबाउट ऑप्टिमाइजिंग रेडार सिग्नल प्रोसेसिंग एल्गोरिदम्स ऑन द केडन स्टेंसिलिका फ्यूजन जी थ्री डी एस पी इन अ प्रीवियस केडन्स वाइड बोर्ड वेनजडे वी लुकड एट द द प्रोसेसिंग फ्लो द एल्गोरिदम्स विच आर यूज इन रेडार सिग्नल प्रोसेसिंग दिस picture shows the algorithm blocks which are typically used the beam forming the range doppler fft's and the cfar detection in order to implement these algorithms implementing them on a programmable dsp has uh, advantages it's a flexible software implementation which is particularly useful for a radar signal processor because typically radar signal processor Uh, the modules the functionality needs to be adapted as the radar works in a somewhat different modes depending on the operation for example a radar might work in a search mode it might switch to a track mode and the 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 modules the processing somewhat changes the parameters of the processing change and so it's very flexible and very convenient to implement the processing on a programmable dsp one one key aspect in in implementing algorithms on a dsp is the efficient execution of those algorithms which needs an instruction set architecture of the dsp uh, which can be efficient in implementing those algorithms let's take a look at the key instruction set architecture features the key isa features of the of the fusion g3 dsp fusion g3 is a is a is a vector dsp with vector max and alu it it can do four way four 32 bit integer fixed point multiplies and four way four single precision floating point multiplies it has instructions at sub instructions which help in accelerating fft's it has various vector instructions in particular the min max instructions which are very useful in in one of the modules uh, in in radar processing particularly cfar so in optimizing these these modules on on the dsp for 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 beam forming the the four way multiplies and the four way max is used in optimizing the beam forming module to execute efficiently on the fusion g3 the range doppler fft's make use of the at sub instructions which accelerate the fft's and make the range doppler frequency analysis processing very efficient on the fusion g3 cfars the constant false alarm rate modules uh, there are a few variants of them uh, one of them is called an order statistic cfar which needs to do uh, a min max search on on elements that's where the vector min max instructions can be efficiently used to optimize the cfar detection module so the so using these vector instructions of the fusion g3 dsp each of these modules and radar signal processing algorithms in general can be efficiently implemented and they are very efficient in their cycles performance i i invite you to take a look at our white papers and application notes on this topic of optimizing radar signal processing algorithms on the cadence fusion g3 dsp that was an overview of of mapping the algorithms on the fusion g3 thank you very much see you again in a next cadence whiteboard wednesday